Uh, Rosanna, Jeff Beccaro, been done to death on the interweb. I know that. This is nothing new. I'm breaking no ground here. However, for those of you that want a very simple, clear breakdown of the triplet groove with where the grace note fits in, because it was a guy in the pub last night, Ozzy Mark. He knows his metal music guitars and drummers. Uh, and he's got some crossover into other styles. He knows his stuff, but he said, hey, man, I won't do the accent. Hey, you're gonna get rid of my word. Don't do the accent. <clears throat> he said the biggest test, or a litmus test of most drummers is if they can pull off Jeff Beccaro's groove in Rosanna. So that's what led to this. Actually, we were gonna do something else. We were gonna get Ben, another Australian, to put some bass down on um, Stevie Wonder's I Wish. But um, uh, but Ben, uh, Ben has had a motorcycle accident. Why am I smiling? He's, co he's come off his bike. He's in fucking hospital. <laughs> Shit. But I know he's okay because he's joking from his phone. So, you know, he's, he's all right. Two, three, four. I'll slow down. Obviously, accent on the one, the other two notes of the triplet pattern, grace notes, four. Or up speed. You get the idea. And the other crucial part, obviously, is the way the bass drum comes in and out. That kind of thing. Yeah. And triplet ending with two on the bass drum. Beautiful groove. It's a similar thing with Jeff in that the, these rock drummers, you have to, you know, if you haven't already done the swingy shuffle thing, now is the time. Uh, From that, a bit of freestyle, go big.